Oh, oh dear. Sweetie, I thought you'd never ask. Oh no. What have I done? Look at this fucking face. They float off into the sunset together. <laughs> what an ignominious end to the stories. <laughs> oh, that was a fantastic idea, Sprawl. <laughs> we did it, guys. <laughs> oh, we win. Oh, Jesus. in here oh my god what is this oh Jesus this is a fucking mess <laughs> oh I need to highlight that later <laughs> I don't want to go in here yet I'll come back to you later uh, scantily clad woman what where? You can't see anything over there. <laughs> what are you doing? I totally can. What? Oh, okay. It's the other side of here. Alright. Uh, no. Don't walk towards... Larry... Garrett... Fucking... That way. That sounds about right. Oh, is that the trash can? Good idea. You know in every game, Al Lowe always hides something in the garbage can. You can't wait to find out what it will be in this game. Fool you! Nothing. Nada. Zipola. But now your hands smell like a fishmonger. <laughs> Fantastic. Take this towel. I thought I, I tried to earlier. It didn't let me. These towel hooks... Oh, hey, there's another woman over there. There's not much to do in the... There's not... There's not... There, there's... There. Oh, wait. If you want to take a shower, get undressed first, then use the hand icon. Uh, okay. You care... Ah. You hope... Take me. I'm mine. There's not much... I can't take a shower. If you want it... I can't get undressed. Oh, maybe I have to take my clothes off in the other room. Take. Take me. Off clothes. Hehehe, <laughs> that tickles. Yeah, women's locker room is fucking messy. Okay. Take me. Take There's off not clothes. much to. Oh. Oh. Hey. You really like that, don't you? Could you just wait a little while before we do that again? <laughs> oh, unzip in here, maybe. You carefully, ah, you no, hope, I can't. wait, or use the swimming. God damn it. All right, fuck it. Let's go into this terrible room again. Oh, God, this room is a mess. What am I looking at here? What is this thing? What a massive piece of plumbing. <laughs> I wish I had a dollar for every time I've heard that. Not. This thing sucks. Obviously something goes on in this room that requires quite a bit of pressure. Uh, I need to change that. Uh, stupid auto save. Turn that off. Cancel. And I probably should save it. Obviously, so the flowers smell sweet, but with a strange underlying aroma of something unpleasant. We'll get to her. You'd love to do things with this woman, but you can't do things you'd like to do by doing that thing you were just doing. Okay, fine. I'll talk to the woman. Hey. 
Hello, miss. My name is Larry. Larry Laffer? <laughs> okay. Rosé has deep, dark, penetrating, liquid brown eyes. No wonder she's in charge of high colonics. Oh, dear. You are up close and personal with Rosé Elita, one spicy little Spanish number who runs La Costellata's High Colonic Treatment Center. Rosé is wearing a flowered tube top that accentuates her petite but perfectly proportioned pair of protuberances. <laughs> Boobs. All right, let's talk to her. Oh, I gotta grab her face first. Rosé's eyes tell volumes. Play your cards right and she may turn up your volume. hey -o. Hey, look. I've got your nose. I've got your nose. <laughs> <laughs> you sound like my old uncle. He is always playing that joke on me. <laughs> That's the first thing Larry has said to this woman. <laughs> Welcome to La Casa Lata's High Colonic Treatment Suite, Mr. Laffer. Your presence here is welcome to me, Rose Alita, on your attendant person duty. Uh, thanks, Rose. <laughs> nice to meet you, too. <laughs> You're in charge of haiku lyrics? Okie dokie, it is, Laffer. Sometimes I understand not your English so good. You see, Rosé, very new in U.S. of A. From Spain, I have come just. <laughs> How long have you been in this country, Rosé? Mm, maybe 3,000 miles. In country, not far. But English speak good, no? Uh, no. Um, I mean, yes. Uh, no, Smart, I did not. What brought you to America? I assume by Airplane. your talent that I will need them. But what I mean is, why did you leave Spain and journey all this way? Does she want Simply. lard? To America I come to be an au pair for a pair of children. Au pair, huh? You must enjoy working with children, huh? No, making children much more to my liking. But give up tending children, I did. Bad hours. Expect you to leave bed during night. Not Rosé. When bed I go, I go for hours. Yeah, I wish I had a dollar for every time I've heard that. Rosé, would you like to try a little something special with me? I consider myself quite the continental type. <laughs> Very sophisticated and uh, urbane. Just that nice. But where I come from, women expect gift before freebie. Say, this girl is continental. Do you want lard? What? Why did you think I would want something like that? I have not needs for such a, how you say, thingy. I guess not. All right, what do you want then? I can understand how a woman might want a gift, <laughs> but um, what exactly would please you, Rosé? Just look around you, Lawrence. Tell my likes. You know you can. Hmm, I see. Why don't women ever give you a straight answer? I can under- <laughs> Why don't- Fucking women, right? <laughs> I think she likes flowers. I take it that's why you mentioned it. A dispenser of lubricant hang. You really don't want to get your hands all covered with slippery lubricant. Is that right? How delightfully- I did a bunch of shit in my room. I thought I did. Well, I would I would assume that she wants the flowers. That would be my guess. That's a safe guess because the room is covered in flowers. Uh. It's still on. You run your hand over the lavish carpeting. Yeah, what's this stuff in my hand? Yeah, sure, her name is Rose. Oh, hey, there you go. 
can do more shit with your phone too, alright? I'm sure I can call the all these numbers. Uh, I don't know if I want to though. How about number 76? Yes, hello, this is Building Maintenance, Landscaping and Grounds. May I please to be helping you? Hello? There's brown water coming out of my bathroom sink. Oh, hey, is there that. anything you can do about it? Ah, yes, but of course, Mr. Laffer. I am so sorry. Let me send up one of our best men. Right away, pronto, soon, quick, quick. Oh, and please to be accepting our sincere apology for any inconvenience and perhaps if you are suffering. Ah, uh, perhaps I can make some adjustment to your bill. Please, okay, just a moment while I check the computer. Oh, I see. Never mind. Uh, Mr. Laffer, I'll be sure to send up somebody sometime. Maybe in a few hours. Maybe never. And please, don't bother calling back. Well, okay. Fine. Alright. So I guess I don't have enough money. The pink tell. Who else can I call? Uh, housekeeping. 75. I was going to call them once anyways, but let's see what they do. Housekeeping, may I help you? This is Larry Laffer. <laughs> yeah, I notice you have something called a turn down service. Is this something I need to request? Usually I have no trouble getting turned down. <laughs> yes, you do, Mr. Laffer. I'll make a note of it. This evening, we leave a little gift for you and your pillow. Oh boy, pillow. I love presents. Oh boy. Call it twice, you say, Sprawl. This will end up killing me, won't it? Housekeeping? Yes, my bathroom is totally unstocked. Uh, don't you give lots of little free thingies here? You know, shower caps, tiny bottles of shampoo, shoehorns, stuff like that? Why no, we don't. Well, how about toilet paper, towels, washcloths, you know, I should get those, right? Yes, you should. I'll send a <laughs> maid up to service you right away. All right. Fucking <laughs> thumbs That would be fine. Tell her to just barge right in, regardless of the condition I'm in. Oh, our help never enters a guest room while someone is there. Strict the policy. Simple courtesy, you know. Also, it prevents lawsuits from schmucks who want to accost our maids. Aww. No. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I suppose I'll head down to the pool now. Good. The sooner you leave, the sooner you'll get serviced. Well, I'll go to the pool, but I, but I want to... You run your head... Yeah. I want to call some more numbers first. The pink... Uh, how about the excursion, Jess? 74. I want to go on an excursion. Hello. You've reached La Costa Lata's excursion desk. For tomorrow, we have planned a wonderful trip for your vacationing pleasure. Our American Empress tour will begin early in the morning with a trip through an authentic local fast food <laughs> restaurant's drive-up window. Next, we will travel to an indigenous nearby area to study native shopping rituals, followed by a trip to an actual functioning supermarket. <laughs> You'll enjoy lunch at a local diner, followed by a short hop into an authentic laundromat, where you'll see locals engage in traditional activities before your very eyes. The afternoon will conclude with a visit to a real automobile repair center, where hapless locals sit trapped, waiting and watching television while their children run wild all around them. This tour sounds terrible. We'll return in plenty of time for you to shower and clean up before anyone sees you. Don't miss this exciting look at a life you've never seen. Only $350 per person, meals included. Only... Li terrible. Alright. Uh, what about the concierge desk? The pink... Concierge is 73. 
I love how there are so many options to pick food. It's like, oh, you can't order any of them because you're cheap. You don't have any money. Concierge desk, Carlos speaking. If you ever go in for brain surgery, prepare to pay extra for a finder's fee. Senor, want to lose 10 ugly pounds? Cut off your head. The day you were born, senor, your parents went to a lawyer hoping to find a loophole in your birth certificate. I don't know how old you are, senor, but you sure look it. You should exercise more to work off some of the fat above your neck. You know, amigo, you could make a living hiring yourself out to frighten little children. Your brain is one of the largest undeveloped areas of the world. Is that your face or did you lie down in front of a truck? You got an open mind and a mouth to match. You got the whitest teeth I've ever come across. Your mouth is so big, when you yawn, your face disappears. Every person has the right to be ugly, but you abuse the privilege. The last time I saw a face like yours, it was stuck in a bag of old. You had a nice figure. About 100 pounds ago. Ooh, bad breath is one thing, but you could knock a buzzard off a garbage truck. You know, your elevator doesn't quite reach your penthouse. You know, your left eye must be real fascinating, because your right eye keeps looking at it. Why is this happening? When you were born, they threw away the mold. Unfortunately, some of it grew back. You're something that one only meets in a bad dream scene. You're the world's happiest amigo. If ignorance really is bliss. Want to lose a quick five pounds? <laughs> Brush your teeth. You know your porch light is on, but nobody's home. You guys, I've, I've mentioned that I there work There is one good thing about your body. It isn't as ugly as your face. And I don't work with the front desk. If you were a stripper, they'd yell, put it on! You know, you... Oh my I god, never shut up. You could be... You're more... You have them. You're just not. You know. What's this? You want the second. You're always learning new. Way. Oh, please. I always. In You'd be a perfect. Oh, you have. Shut up. If ignorant. Women think you're dark. Whoa. You could have a. You know. Why are you doing this still? Can someone look up on the fact and see if, if that's actually something it, that, that is? You have more face to wash and less hair to comb every... Have a nice day. Oh, okay. <laughs> why? Why? What? The pain... Why was that a thing? Oh, God. Fuck the phone. Oh, God. I'm getting out of this room. The maid's cart is filled with the usual towels and washcloths, plus lots of other freebies which she places in the guests' bathrooms. Funny? You haven't seen any of this stuff in your bathroom. Oh shit, I'm gonna swipe everything. This washcloth feels almost like a bath towel. You don't really need that. She was probably going to give you a fresh roll of toilet paper today anyway. Don't be greedy. Hand cream might be good for those itchy palms of yours. You don't really... You don't really... I'll bet the maid was going to leave me a washcloth. You don't... Use this when... You already... You already... You don't... Don't... You... 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 You don't... You all... You don't... You all... You don't... Don't... Don't be... You don't... Make okay. you shout to the up or Okay, anyways. Piss in the toilet, you say. Okay. Like every up This is. Yeah. Okay, I'm pissing in the toilet. Alright. You careful. Ah. You hope. Finally. The right place. <laughs> Fantastic. You flush the toilet. Toilet seat cover. What, what do I have in here? Uh, I have 
kind of hand Pure cream. aloe vera hand lotion. <laughs> aloe. <laughs> uh, Your complimentary bar of impressive imported oat bran soap would be more impressive if it had come in a wrapper. But... Your but for an unwrapped bar of soap, it is impressive. The roll of toilet paper is a delicate shade of off-white. It's called white. Why is that little speck of red on it? La Costellata's washcloths are so soft and fluffy. Not at all like yours back home. All right. Can I combine the hand lotion with... Hmm? No, I guess not. Hmm? Mm, 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 mm. Toilet seat cover. Oh, the cart disappeared. Uh, can I get back into it? Maybe I have to call the maid again. Hello. You own the one. What number was it? Seventy-five. Housekeeping. Hi. Yeah. Why? Yes, you did, Mr. Laffer. Someone will be up to your room very soon. But perhaps you didn't know. I'm sure once you leave the room, the maid will slip in unobserved and take care. I guess I'm just not used to fine service. <laughs> My pleasure. Sure. Look on the back of the cart. The cart is, is disappeared. The cart is no longer here. Maybe I grabbed everything. There is no cart. Oh, there's the cart. The maid's cart is filled with the usual towels and washcloths, plus la funny. A package of thin paper toilet seat covers rests on the cart. These toilet seat covers are kind of thin, but uh, if I don't put my full weight down, I'm sure they can last through one sitting. I could use these for tracing paper. I bet I could use a towel sometime. Leave some towel. I can always use some more dental floss. You already have a year-long supply of dental floss, since you insist upon ignoring your dentist's good advice and flossing only when I have plenty of time, as if your busy schedule prevents you from taking good care of your teeth. The ADA will never make you their poster boy. I'll piss off the fucking narrator. You already the A you don't. Uh, what else do we have? What a ritzy resort! A package of th this shell. The back of the cart contains objects not visible from the... Okay, got all this. Make sure I got everything from the front. The maid's cart is filled with... Funny. The front of the cart contains objects toilet not paper, visible from the back side. Rolls cream. of toilet right, paper. Alright. we got so much shit now. Holy hell. What do I do with all this stuff? Can I put the uh, toilet seat thing on my... thing in my room? There's another door, isn't there? What's in here? Wow! Tress, cool! <laughs> Complimentary leisure suits! Oh, fantastic. Oh, God. Where the fuck do you come from? Mark, the spa plumber lies under your sink working hard to correct your brown water. Wouldn't you think he'd be uncomfortable lying on that huge tool belt? Ooh, hey, that tickles. Hey, what are you, some kind of fan? Oh my god. Get your hands off of me. Holy shit. Throwing out the, throwing out the F-bomb over here. Say, I bet he'd never miss a simple adjustable wrench. Thanks for coming so fast. I wish I had a dollar for every time I heard that. Huh? No, I, I mean thanks for fixing my sink so quickly. <laughs> Is it done yet? Done? Already? Give me a break! You know how many things I gotta get done today? I got people waiting everywhere! 
you think you're the only person in this place with plumbing problems? You guests are all alike. I'm so busy, I don't have time to take a crap anymore. Yeah, I can tell by the way you wear your jeans. Gosh, I'm so sorry you're so busy. How about if I get out of your way? <laughs> See you later. I'll just wait in my room or something. Oh, yeah, good idea. The sooner you leave me alone, the sooner I'll get this done! I don't think he'll be into it. Jeez, what an asshole. Jeez, what an asshole. What an asshole. Oh, let me guess. Just in from San Francisco. Oh, what? Whew. <laughs> Say, I bet he'd never miss a simple file. Mark has nothing more for you to steal. Uh... All right, so I got a file now. The plumber doesn't care to watch you right now. Fantastic. <coughs> Let's get out of here. Look on the bed. Okay, there's a thing on the bed. Are you done already? I got your water problem taken care of, Mr. Leper. <laughs> you won't have any more troubles now. Thank you. If I do, I'll ask for you. How did I know that? It feels somewhat like a condom. Of course, your memories of what a condom feels like are a little hazy. You grab the condom from your pillow. Oh my god, I'm getting so many items. Oh god, are any of these things that can help me get laid? The pink tell. Can I put the condom on me? Here? Now? Why? I guess that's a no. He's hard to find him. I could try, I guess. Hmm? Flossing oh, your- hello. Larry, it's a male condom. What? Oh, because it's going on a beaver. I get it. Hmm? Flossing your teeth afterwards? A possibility. Wouldn't that ruin it? Be careful. That file would really be rough on your beaver. I'm kind of impressed with sure, the, uh... this file would easily alter your room key. But then you'd never be able to enter your room again. I'm really impressed with the level of, level of detail mm -hmm. they went through mm -hmm. some of these combinations. Mm -hmm. Sure. That mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, let the chips fall where they may. While you could, you take that. You shout or maybe. 